Yeah, well, I started, I think, when I was 13, and in, uh, what now I think is called the DPP. I was picked up by Colin Osborne in a, in a county game, I think, and then was lucky enough to come all the way through and then get signed at 18, and then made my first team appearance, I think, in that year. I think I made two in that season. Played Newcastle in Newcastle, which, as usually was, I think it was wet and windy, and then I think I backed it up the next week against Gloucester. So, yeah, it was, it was an awesome experience to get that first couple of caps. It's a bit of a whirlwind, really. You get thrown into the environment, and you remember sort of going in, I think, Ugo had just come back from the British Lions tour, and you're there training with these guys when you first go in. And then to sort of win the um, the trophies early on, I think you know won the the Challenge Cup. Well, is now the Challenge Cup. Um, you win the Premiership and then the LV Cup. First couple of years or first four or five seasons of my career was mad. That you sort of you look back on it now and you re appreciate, I think, more how big an achievement that was. And at the time, you sort of like, oh well, I'm I'm here and that's just what happens and. Yeah, it, it does make you appreciate it. and it was, I mean, there were some world-class players here at that time, there still is, and yeah, there's, I'm sure there's exciting times ahead as well. We played Bath in the semi-final the week before, and we had no chance on paper of winning that game. You look around our changing room at the youth that was in there, I think, what, most of us were sort of 22, 23, 24. That kind of age bracket with a couple of senior guys in there, and their team was all first-team players with quite a few internationals. And yeah, you just you just remember it as playing playing with your mates. I remember Luke captain at the time, and we were living together, and it was it was just great fun, a, a great part, and a great thing to be part of. I played the year before. I think got off the bench for 15 minutes or something like that. So I was lucky enough that I'd experienced that kind of environment before. And I was on the bench that day. I, I think Tim got injured quite early on, and I came on quite early and. Yeah, it's, it's a bit easy when you're playing with world-class players around. You remember just getting, I think Brownie put me away on the outside and just was able to put the ball away. And Nick Evans on the, I think on the next one. So, yeah, an, an amazing memory that will always stick with me. We're a very close family with our with our middle brother, middle brother as well. And you know, we got the lucky opportunity to play all together, and that's another memory that sticks out for me in the A League. But. Yeah, when James first started, we, we lived together, myself, him and Luke, and we've always been pretty close. So, yeah, it, it's, it's, a, it's a hard feeling to describe when you look across the change room and you, you see your brothers there. It, it's, a, it's a cool thing to be able to say you've done. You remember a lot of the games throughout your career. There's, there's loads of stuff that sticks out to me, like Gloucester away a couple of times, a couple of big performances there from the team. and. Big game eight, win, like I said, winning the trophies. It's just been an amazing experience in the 10 years that I've I've had, and uh, you know, hopefully there's there's many more to come. There's an exciting future for the club and, and uh, Guzzi and what we're trying to do here. And I think hopefully there's going to be many more seasons. I don't appreciate what it took to win those those trophies early on in my career, and it definitely feels like we're starting to build towards that again. We've, we've got an environment now where we're hungry to try and achieve and you know we've got a massive game coming up this weekend against Worcester which isn't going to be easy but you know we're in a good place and we're going to keep trying to push forward.